Hey guys, it's WWE Nexus 1000, and I'm gonna do a rant, probably a quick rant, but I've actually been requested to do this a while ago, but I don't know, I've just been putting it off. I, don't know why. I really don't have an excuse, but I'm lazy, I guess I can use that as an excuse. I really can't. But anyway. And I rant. I have, I think, three topic question. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get started. I'm just goofy. Um, I have two questions from RKO Viper Fan 93. And the first question was What WWE Championship design do I like the most? Um,. I'd say probably the actual WWE Championship uh, or the Divas Championship because those two champions just have like so much detail added to them. Um, you know, the US and the IC, those are cool, you know, but um, so, but I think they're just kind of bold in a way. Uh, the tag team champions, the new tag team champions, uh, they're pretty cool, but I don't know. Uh, or the world's heavyweight, I guess it has a little bit of detail added. Um, but the older women's champion, it was around for many years, but I still thought it was just kind of a little bit bold. But the Divas champion has a lot added. But my favorite would probably be the actual WWE Champion. Um, but yeah. So, either the WWE or the Divas. So yeah, not much I can say about that. Um, the second one was, what was my favorite year of wrestling? Or favorite time span, or, yeah, I guess. Um, I could probably talk for so long about this, um, but I'll try to make it shorter. <laughs> um, I've probably been watching wrestling since I was, in, I've been watching wrestling my whole life. Um, but when I actually really started watching it and getting into it and knowing what was really, uh, going on and stuff, you know, I can't remember just uh, watching it with my family. I didn't know what was really going on, but I knew everybody was getting into it, so I think I really just grew into it, but, um, uh, yeah, but when I can actually remember is, uh, I think my favorite time span was either 03 to 06, you know, I think I've only... Randy Orton's my favorite, so this will probably all be based around him. Uh, yeah, but he's really the only career I've actually like followed and actually liked and stuck with and everything. But um, 03 to 06 is mainly based around me liking the evolution uh, and the breakup between all of them. You know. I liked Evolution, and uh, when they broke up, I liked the feud between Orton, Triple H, Ric Flair, and Batista, and uh, I just got into that feud, uh, and that was pretty much 03, 04, so uh, when he went over to SmackDown, I liked his career, or the storyline he got over there, because I liked the old Randy Orton and Undertaker feud. That was actually pretty much one of my favorite feuds of him, actually. Um, so I think that was around the 2005 and 6. So, yeah, that was probably my favorite time in his career. One of my favorite time spans. So, 03 to 06. Then I didn't really like the 07 and 08. Uh, I just didn't really get into it as much. 
I, but from 09 to now, I've gotten into some of the storylines. Um, in 09, uh, I think it was like the late 2008, but uh, from, I think it was like December, November of 2008 is when um, Cody Rhodes and Teddy Biasi came in and they made Team Priceless. And I really liked Team Priceless, so I think they had a time when it was, I can't even remember his name. I think it was Manu, and I can't remember. There was somebody else, but they didn't last long. I really just liked the Ted and Cody. I didn't like when they brought the other two in. And then, like, the early 09 is when they put Randy Orton and Team Priceless together and made Legacy, so, you know, I loved, I like Randy Orton, actually I love Randy Orton, and I like Team Priceless, so. so that pretty much ended in, like, the late 2010, and then it's when Nexus came in, and then I like Nexus, I like the storyline between him, them and John Cena, so yeah. And in 2009, I started liking CM Punk, too, so. But, like I said, I babbled for a few minutes about this. <laughs> I can probably babble for longer, but it's just, yeah. So, from 03 to 06, and then from 2009 to now. The only thing I don't like about now is the PG era. I don't like the whole watch what you say, watch what you do, you know. That's not what wrestling like was, and for them to do that, I don't know why they did. But um, yeah. So, but pretty much I've been hooked on the Nexus storyline, which is over now. But yeah, but that's only because I didn't like John Cena. So, <laughs> so yeah, I think I've babbled a lot of time about that. But like I said, I could go on for longer if I wanted to, but. I don't think I can. And, um, last question topic was from Michael Picks Rice 2. I think that's how you say it. And the question was, what do I think about the WWE getting their own channel? I didn't even know they were getting their own channel until you, like, gave me this topic. Um, I don't know why they need their own channel. I, I think that's pretty ridiculous. For like they're doing just fine on USA. Um I heard you have to like pay for the channel. Shocker. WWE is not rich enough. Um but I don't know. I don't think it's a really good idea. You know, I think they might lose fans if they do that. No, I don't know. I don't like I said, I don't really know too much about it, but what I can say is I think they're going to start it next year sometime, which they'll probably start talking about January, February. But, um, they'll probably start talking about it in the early 2012. But, um, you know, I don't really know too much about it. I don't know any details about it yet because they haven't really said too much yet. But, um... If the question is if I think it's a good idea or a bad idea, I think it's a bad idea. I think they should just stick with the USA Network. I don't see why they have to do it, but I guess it's Vince's decision. Uh, but yeah. So n I don't really think it's a good idea. I think they should just stick with what they're with. Um, but yeah, so. When I get more details and they update us on it, I will probably give some more. I'll probably talk about it some more. Um, but there's the rant. And, yeah. I'll talk to you guys later. Send me more topics, questions, makeup tutorials, anything. I mean, so, yeah. I will talk to you guys later. And take care. Bye guys.